Where are you from? It's a simple question, but I've never had a straightforward answer. I was born in Philadelphia, but I was too young to remember anything. I spent most of my life growing up in South Florida. So at least I can say I'm an American. Or am I? Growing up, people always seem to notice my quirks, differences from the typical American. To fit in, I tried to eliminate them. I'd ask my parents, why do I have to eat sopa de quinoa or japingachos? Why couldn't I just have chicken fingers like my friends did? I'm the son of immigrants. Society frequently points that out. I'm Ecuadorian, but am I? My family in Quito would always tell me that I need to practice my Spanish to lose my accent. Rompope. Tienes que pronunciar bien la R. To them, I'd always be a gringo. Oh, no hablas como ecuatoriano. Well, so who am I? To Americans, I'm Latino. To Latinos, I'm gringo. Pero de dónde eres? Tienes un poco de acento. I guess I'm just a little hard to pin down. My life has been a journey of self-discovery. My interests are varied. They had to be. I loved learning more, experiencing more, in the hope of finally finding my place. I speak three languages now, and I'm always trying new ones out. I travel the world to experience new cultures. I become a tourist in my city and a local abroad. But I can't escape this desire to blend in wherever I go, to find something in common with everyone. I surprise people with knowledge of uncommon things. I bounce around between places and interests, almost as if switching masks. I change as the people and places around me do. The truth is, I don't know who I am, or that I ever will. But you know what? That's okay. I've come to find the pleasure in the journey.